Hello everyone. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to run Facebook ads for page likes. The first thing you will need to do is go onto facebook.com. Once on Facebook, you want to sign into your account. Once you have signed into your account, you are going to tap on see all that is right on the left hand menu option below gaming and you are going to select page. After selecting page, if you haven't already created your page, you are going to create your page right here. You can add the page name, the category, and you can also add a bio, which would basically be describing the page. And after doing that, you are going to add a profile pic. Then you are going to add a background banner. And to create a background banner, you can use Canva. Canva is a platform that I would recommend for anyone, whether you are just looking to use it for social media or you plan on using it to create ads or so on. As with Canva, you can sign up for completely free. Once you have signed up with Canva, let's say for this example, we are creating a Facebook cover. All you'll need to do is type in Facebook. Then from there, you could select Facebook cover. After you have done that, you are going to be redirected to this page and you can see numerous templates that you can choose from. So all you have to do is scroll down and whichever template you like, you can simply tap on it and then from there you'll be able to edit it. Once you are finished editing your cover, you'll simply upload it onto your page. Once you have uploaded the page or if you already have your Facebook page that you would like to run the ads to, all you have to do is tap on see all. Then from there, you are going to tap on add. After you have tapped on add, you will be redirected to this page. And I want you to go over to the left hand menu option, right where you see Halloween costumes on my screen. You are going to tap on that and you want to ensure that you have selected the page that you want to run the ads to. So let's say I would like to run the ads to this particular page. All I would have to do is tap on the page. All you have to do is select the page that you would like to run the ads on. Once you have selected the page, all you'll need to do now you have two options. You could either select boost a post. So all you'll need to do is tap on boost a post. Once you have tapped on boost a post, you will be redirected to this page. And from here, you'll be able to select the post that you would like to boost or get some likes on. So you can select the post that you would like as you can see right here. So let's say for example this post, all I would need to do is simply tap on boost post. And once you have tapped on boost post, you will be redirected to the ads page. And from here, you will be able to set up your targeted audience and all of that. So all you will need to do right now, you are going to simply scroll down. Then after scrolling down, you are going to see the post on the right hand column. Then you'll simply scroll down and you're going to tap on the pencil where you see audience. And from there, you'll be able to select whether you like to target all genders or you want to target only men and women. Then from there, you can also select the age group that you would like to target. And after doing that, you can scroll down and you can select the locations that you would like to target. So let's say you want to target United States and you would also like to target persons in Canada. You could simply type in Canada, then tap on that. And you can also get more specific. So let's say instead of it just being general Canada, let's say you would like to target persons in Calgary. All you'll need to do is simply type in that. So you can zone down. So as you can see right here, Calgary, Alberta, you can simply tap on that. Then you'll simply scroll down. After doing that, you are going to see detail targeting. And this will basically mean the interests that you would like to target. So as I'm running a Halloween page, let's say I would like to target persons that like Halloween. So I would type in Halloween right here. And you could tap on Halloween. Then after doing that, I could simply type in scary movie. So I could do that also. So you could type in scary right there and you'll see horror movies as persons that tend to like horror movie would normally like Halloween costumes. As you can see right here, you get the idea and you will simply type in different interests. 
after typing in different interests by scrolling down you can see the estimated audience that you'll be able to attract then you are going to tap on save audience once you have tapped on save audience all you'll need to do now is go right where you see duration and from here you are going to decide how long you would like your ads to run whether you like them to run for seven days or less you can do that all you'll need to do is select the duration that you want so I would like my ads to run for five days after you have done that you are going to select when you would like it to end and when you would like it to end let's say I would like it to end 18 I could do that and you can select when you would like it to start after you have done that you are going to see total budget so you'll simply tap on the pencil icon right here and from here let's say I would like to spend ten dollars per day I would type in ten dollars then below it you'll see placements and this basically means where you would like your ads to show up would you like it to be only shown on Facebook or would you like it to be shown also on Instagram you could simply tick Instagram if you want it only on Facebook you would untick Instagram if you want it to also be shown on messenger you could simply tick messenger once you have done this all you will need to do now is simply scroll down then you are going to add your payment method and you can see the estimated daily results right here so you can see post engagement estimated to be between 24 to 68 and you can see my budget right there and all I'll need to do now is tap on boost post in the bottom right hand corner and that's basically it and that's basically it on how to boost a post another way how you could do this is let's go back so let's say I were to go back onto the home page once on the home page again all you'll need to do is go over to the left hand menu option tap on see all after you have tapped on see all again I want you to select ads let me show you the second method that you could use so you are going to tap on add once you have tapped on add you will be redirected to this page and you could tap on create new ad after you have tapped on create new ad again from here you can select the post that you'd like to use so you could tap on user post as we are running this for likes once you have selected the post all you will need to do now is scroll down you are going to add the headline then you are going to tap on button label after you have tapped on button label you will see these different call to actions as you can see right here so all you have to do is scroll down and you are going to tap right where you see like page so we are going to tap on that once you have selected like page you are going to scroll down and just like what I showed you earlier you can choose the target audience and you can also set up the duration and the budget then from there you are going to select the placement and you are going to tap on promote now, now in the bottom right hand corner hope you found this tutorial helpful if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe